guys, Thrifting Bee here. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the minimalism game. Today is the start of week two and we are going to be getting rid of eight items and then nine items, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So excited to be decluttering my house. I hope you guys are joining along with us. Um, there are a couple of us doing this minimalism game. It's being hosted by Mallory from Minimalish Mom. And I will make sure to link anybody else who's participating down below. So make sure to check out the description box. If you like decluttering, if you like thrift hauls, if you like Dollar Tree hauls, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Show me some love. I'm always happy when people show me love. And if you are doing a decluttering series or if you're doing spring cleaning, if you do thrift hauls, Dollar Tree hauls, Leave me a comment down below. I'd love to come and check out your channel. Anyways, with that being said, let's go ahead and get started with this minimalism game, week two. Hey everyone, welcome to day eight. And here are my eight items that I'm gonna donate. I'm gonna start putting them in this box this week because I want to take them all at once to the thrift store. So the first item that I'm gonna donate, we'll start with the big one is this container um it was in my daughter's bedroom it's a cute container it was in my daughter's bedroom but it's a little sh like crooked i'm sure somebody will still want to use it we ended up buying her new containers for her pajamas and instead of folding things i just kind of throw them in containers and so i bought her a bigger one and this one i'm gonna donate will it fit in there in the box looks like everything's gonna have to go in there the next big item is this bucket. It's like a little Easter bucket. I don't know what to do with these Easter buckets. It was 98 cents. We buy one every year, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and donate that, this one. It's a cute little butterfly one. I'm also getting rid of this basket. Um, I went through like a container phase, so I bought a bunch of baskets and stuff, so I'm just gonna get rid of that one because I have no use for that one. So wait, that was one, two, three items. I'm gonna count these hangers as four items. Um, I mean, not four items, as one item, but it'll be item number four because, well, you know, I don't wanna count each one as an individual item. So we'll count this as item number four. And then the next thing that I'm gonna donate is this cute little bag. Um, it used to hold like tools and stuff like gardening tools super cute but the girls never used it so that's item number five item number six is this cute little safety first kit it still has like a toothbrush and little scissors things that i never used with the baby so i'm gonna go ahead and donate that so that's four five six item number seven is these little mini mouse sandals and they're just cute little chanclas. Um, so that's item number seven. A lot of stuff came from the baby's room this week. Or this day. And then item number eight is this little ladybug plush. We have so many plushes in this house. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of that. Hey guys, welcome to day number nine. And here are the nine items that I'm going to donate for day number nine. So the first thing that I'm going to donate is this hair tie. It was from my daughter's soccer club. And so I'm just going to go ahead and donate that. The next item that I'm donating are these little shark. Um, the next item that I'm going to donate is this little plush. Um, it's just a little reindeer plush. So I'm going to go ahead and put him in the box. So I forgot how many items we had already. So we had the hair tie, one the shark two that we're going to toss three four five so we have five items so far oh look there's a little car that came with the bag so we're just going to toss that in there as a freebie because trust me guys i'm going to have enough to donate for this entire entire minimalism game all right so that was five so i got these four books the first one is learning games with dora it doesn't play but, I mean, it's so cool for, like, you know, learning the numbers in English and Spanish. Then you have Curious George ABCs. 
You have Pinocchio, Disney's Pinocchio. And you have this book called What Can Rabbits See? So these books I'm actually not going to take to the thrift store. Um, we have what you call a free little library in our neighborhood. And what you do is you go and you drop off books and they're free and somebody can go go ahead and then pick books up. So this one's a little torn. So maybe this one I won't take to the little library, but the other ones I will take to the little library. So those are my nine items. Um, I will see you tomorrow with ten items. Here's the current situation in the house. The hubby is playing the video games and the pup is like hanging out with him. But anyways, we are doing day ten today. And I went back into the baby's room because she has a lot of stuff to get rid of, so why not? And so the 10 items came from her room again. We are getting rid of this Ninja Turtle action figure. We're getting rid of these chunklas. She outgrew a lot of her shoes. We're getting rid of these shoes, which are like little water shoes. We're getting rid of these little purple shoes that are, I think they're like Paw Patrol. I don't know, but we're getting rid of these because they don't fit anymore. She's got little big feet. So that was one, two, three, four items. So this is item number five. It's just a little cube. She's almost three now, so that's kind of for a younger kid. We're also going to get rid of this Play-Doh because they don't like playing with it and it might even... No, it's still pretty good. So we're going to get rid of this Play-Doh because I got it from the Dollar Tree and they didn't really like it. Oh no, that fell. I'll have to go pick it up. So that was 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Are we on day 10 or day 11? We're on day 10. I can't even count, you guys. So there's four more books that I'm going to take to the library that I was telling you guys about yesterday the free little library so I'm going to take these four books and hopefully someone gives them a good home. So that's it for the 10 items. Hey guys, day 11 and here are my 11 items. I apologize that I'm not actually showing you where I'm getting these items from. Literally I'm going through my house and just grabbing whatever I find that I know I can get rid of. Um, and I don't film this until nighttime after the baby's gone to sleep otherwise I wouldn't be able to film this. But literally just randomly going through different spots of the house and being like, alright, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone. So, today is day 11, so these are my 11 items. We have one, two, these are 20 lights that I got from the Dollar Tree that I was going to use for a project that didn't end up working out. We have an L magazine that I never read, and honestly, I mean, am I ever going to read it? Probably not, so maybe somebody else can get it a good use. So my item number three is this movie called Wicker Park. It's an old movie. I used to really like it, but uh, I've never, I haven't seen it in years. So that's number three, or actually, sorry, one, two, three, four. Number five is this little shovel that I found in the playroom, tucked away somewhere as I was cleaning up. So I just need to get rid of that. So that's item number five. Item number six, my daughters decided to get rid of this. They saw me picking stuff up and they were like, hey, can we get rid of that? So I said, why not? Item number seven is this little McDonald's toy. It's just a little Mario. Item number eight is this little Barbie doll thing. Item number nine is another McDonald's thing. I feel like these are all McDonald's things. Item number ten is this Pokemon card. My kids have so many Pokemon cards. This one's still in its package. Somebody else will get good use of it. And I counted this as one item because I really didn't want to count those ornaments as like each an item with this basket, so that's one item. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven items. So we'll be back tomorrow. Hey guys, welcome to day 12, and here are my 12 items that I'm going to be donating. So we'll start off with this little bucket. I mean, we're not really using it, so that's one. Little Stuffed Monster is two, Stuffed Dolphin is three, Stuffed Fake Dory is four, Stuffed Snoopy is five, Stuffed Doggy is six, 
This little character from the Minions movie with her fluffy unicorn is seven. Stuffed doll is eight. Stuffed ball is nine. Slingshot is ten. Excuse the noise. The kiddos are being really loud. Rattle is eleven. And this My Little Pony is twelve. There's going to be a lot of items that come out of the playroom because honestly that's like my goal to empty out the playroom. Welcome to day 13. I know it doesn't seem like 13 items but there's some more items back there. But these are my 13 items. I actually have a couple more big ticket items this round. So, first item is this Paris... Um, lamp and I'm actually gonna throw this away because I feel like it's a hazard so the bulb broke and like it just seems really unsafe to me so I don't even want to donate this baby maybe if I remove like this part and just have it be like a tower I don't know I'll take a look at it but I think I'm just gonna throw it away then I have this weekly planner in my madness of trying to get more organized I bought this and almost never used it. So, I'm just going to get rid of it. And I don't know why there's tape, like, all across the top of it. I don't understand. I don't know what I did to it. Oh, you know what? I think it fell once and, like, this part came off. So, I had to tape it. Anyway, so that's that. This is a scale, and oh, it's got a crack on it. I was going to try to sell it, but I just realized it has a crack on it. So we're going to donate it instead. So that's item number three. Item number four is this pie face game. I actually bought it at a thrift store, and it didn't come with a little hand. So we're going to donate it back. Somebody else can use it and try to find a little hand. Or maybe someone can use it for extra pieces. I got this at Ikea. Um, I used to hold my rolls of, um, what do you call it? Why am I blanking? Wrapping paper, but then I have way too much wrapping paper to hold it in here. So I'm going to go ahead and donate that. So that's one, two, three, four, five items. Item number six, I also purchased from the thrift store and I'm going to give it right back because it just didn't work out for us. We had it for a few months and I was taking up too much space. So we're going to give that back. Item number seven is this little Elmo key thing. Um, I was going to donate it to a program that gives toys for babies and moms in need, but I never got around to it, so we're just going to donate it to the thrift store. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Guys, you got to help me keep track because I lose track. So we're on item number seven. So here is four items. It is the Chuck Season 1 series. So we have eight, nine, ten. 11 and so I'm going to donate those we got them at Blockbuster when Blockbuster was going out of business so if someone might be a fan of Chuck they can go ahead and purchase that at the thrift store item number 12 is this mini muffin pan I have a lot of muffin pans and so I needed to clear out some space so we're going to get rid of that and then last but not least, item number 13 is this cute little Coca-Cola fridge. I would have cleaned it up and sold it. Maybe I can clean it up and sell it for like $5 if it still works. Maybe it just needs a good little wipe down. I'll check it out. If it needs just a wipe down, I'm going to post it for sale for like 5 bucks or something, 10 bucks, and somebody can come and pick it up. Um, otherwise, those are my 13 items that I'm going to go ahead and donate to the thrift store. Now, they're not going to fit in that box. So I'm going to have to figure out a way to transport these items and I'll come back tomorrow for you guys with items, with 14 items for day 14 and it'll be the last day for this week and then I'm going to take those to the thrift store and I might bring you guys along with me to check out the thrift store that I donate at. So those are my 13 items. Mm -hmm. decluttered for day 14 and so for day 14 we did this vest from their brownies they're no longer in Girl Scouts so we're gonna donate that so that's one we donated this dress because they don't like it that's two 
donated this shirt because it's old and raggedy. That's three. We might even just toss this. Um, these pair of shorts because they don't fit them anymore. That's four. Another pair of shorts that doesn't fit. That's five. This cute little dress that unfortunately doesn't fit. That's six. This other shirt. That's seven. Then we have this cute, cute dress that I really like. That's eight. Okay. These shorts are nine. This is from the baby's closet. I don't even know why she still had this in there, but that's ten. Right? I'm at ten? Yes. Yeah. Okay. This shorts is eleven. This dress is also from the baby's closet, and as you can see, someone's going to have to take the stains off. That's 12. This t-shirt that was in their closet, but it doesn't fit them. That's 13. And last but not least, this pajama. That's 14. So that is 14 items. Those are all the items for week two. We're going to put them in the car tonight and take them to the thrift store tomorrow. And so I'm going to show you guys the entire, um, the entire lot for week two. Okay? So we'll be right back. All right. So these are all of the items for week two from day eight through day 14. And if I did my calculations right, um, there should be a total of 77 items. That is crazy. I can't believe how easy it was to get rid of 77 items in the house. And there's still so much crap around the house. Those items aren't going to a thrift store. These are items that um, the girls leave downstairs and have to go back upstairs. So I just put them in a bin. And then once a day or twice a day, we take all the stuff upstairs. That way we don't have to make a million trips. Anyways, I digress. So these are all the items that are going to the thrift store. My husband's going to put them in the car tonight. But we're going to take them tomorrow because it's already late. And so, yeah, these items are going to go to the thrift store. I'm so excited to get rid of all of these items. Mm -hmm. 